<laughs> What's up, gamers? It's your boy. Launchpad 1412. Excited to be back with some Madden 21 gameplay here. We got an online ranked match versus a random opponent. We got a divisional rivalry set up here. You know, I had the Chicago Bears suggested by a subscriber knocking down those pins, delivering that mail. You guys know how to do. We're going to be against Aaron Rodgers and the Green Bay Packers, man. And, and this was a really good game. This is probably uh, the best game you guys have seen on here in quite some time. I know the last about three or four games, I'm, <laughs> I'm pretty much. Uh, making people quit uh kind of blowing them out but um this is not that game this is not that game right here and um i'm happy to present it to you guys happy you guys are able to see this as my opponent he was killing with this play right here man um people usually do that in mud uh usually so um i'm assuming this guy's a mud player like he he does both kind of like i do well I, I i do both it's not really kind of i do do both but yeah um he did that to me about three or four times and it's just a hard play to stop so you know i, I, I can kind of understand why people do it um, it, it don't feel it doesn't feel like unstoppable to where it's like cheese but um it, it's definitely tough if you're not you know anticipating it but anyway you know we're still in a pass happy mode i know i told you guys that um eventually i would get in um you know probably get back to running the ball a little bit more i kind of miss it a little bit um I, I just went to the pass happy mode as of the last month basically <laughs> because um it wasn't that i was i was getting bored with the game but i just wanted to you know to do something different man bring something different to you guys um you know be a little bit more exciting as far as a, you know as a, a channel and you know don't get me wrong sometimes I'm, I'm gonna go back to this but it depends on how I feel that day you know every day is different man you know everybody um, has different personalities about every different thing but we all got you know the same personalities all in one so in, you know, in every any day um, you, you just don't know you know what person you're going to get sometimes when it comes to even yourself you know so that's why I always uh, let's get a beautiful interception right here, man. <laughs> it's your boy looking good, Billy Ray. <laughs> and that's why, like, when I um, when I try to I try to remember that when I'm approaching people in life, because it I think everybody thinks people should be a certain way, you know. And you know, to a degree, I I, I think that sometimes uh, too. Um, as we get another interception. But you also have to understand that, you know, humans can, can be complicated. <laughs> you know, humans can be complicated. You got to understand that as well. And, you know, just because, you know, a person is acting in a certain way one day, not giving nobody a pass to be rude or anything, but it doesn't necessarily define um, who they are. And you got to, you know, as a human species, we got to learn how to, you know, to get over things quickly one of the best advice i can give anybody in life is to get over things quickly um, my old head told me that when i was like 15 16 years old he said one of the best advices i can give you to get over stuff quickly um the quicker you get over something the better <laughs> you know and i i've been taking that advice you know ever since because before that you know I, I just um i took practically everything to the head and i'm not sure how we got on this topic but <laughs> maybe somebody need to hear it but yeah man it just uh it just it was a it was a good lesson to teach me at the time, and, I, and I've been I've been kind of hanging you know my head on that, and uh, it's worked wonders, man. So yeah, man, this uh, you just got to give people time. You, know, you got to give people time. But at any rate, <laughs> you know, sacking our opponent right there, pushing him back about eight yards. He tried that play again, but it didn't work out like um like it did earlier. And right here, he throws an interception. I was shocked I caught that because usually when the the linebacker is um has his back turned. He usually doesn't catch it, but I guess because it was called Khalil Mack, we, he caught it. But um, normally that doesn't happen. So three interceptions for this guy, one for me, and the score is still 7-7, seven seven, but we go over the middle to middle time, man. Middle time in a huge play. Top of the fourth quarter, I'll take that. Miller again with, with another catch. Second down to six, we hit uh, Cordell Patterson. They got him at running back for some strange reason. I, I'm not sure why. Uh, when you got Mike Montgomery there, I'm <laughs> I don't know what's going on. I gotta uh, change that setting because he's really not a running back. Um, I had to change the Bengals setting because when I was playing with the Bengals one time, um, they had the backup and they didn't have the boy and um, uh, the rookie. I can't even think of his name. They didn't even have men. Um, but yeah, that's, that's all good. Seven to ten, and this is um, this is kind of like a, a classic launch pad game right here. These are games that uh, I used to show you guys all the time. Where it's like low scoring. Look at the beautiful pick right there. Now, I remind you guys, I could I could have just ended it right here, but I was like, you know what, man, it's 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 mad in the middle of the season. Um, you know, we're, we're not going to get any rewards for winning this game. 
I don't necessarily have to be, you know, that type of guy. I just wasn't in the mood to just, you know, just hold it and just this and that. Like, no, I'm, I'm just going, I'm just going to throw it, man. So third and thir three, third and thirteen, we go deep, um, right there, and doesn't get anything. But check out this, we do get this conversion right here on a fourth and thirteen. Look at that catch! Oh my goodness, I know that hurt, man. I know that hurt his soul when I caught that. <laughs> my goodness. But yeah, this is a classic uh, launch pad game. Uh, at least the old launch pad, you know, low scoring. Uh, some tough defense, but somehow my opponent is still in the game. I, I didn't force this guy to throw four interceptions, and somehow, some way, he's only down three. <laughs> like, it's crazy. It is. I, I know. I know it depends on when you get the interceptions at times, but man, that's still kind of nuts, man. Just imagine getting getting like four, sometimes even six turnovers, but you but you're like down uh, a touchdown or something. That that's happened to me many a times, and I've had to come back and. and and win the game or lose the game by like a field goal or something like it's, it's, it's really really nuts but shout out to my opponent um it's nice to see this part of the game again it's been a while but i've been making people quit so <laughs> to see the highlights and stuff like that um let's let's cherish this because I mean, we don't know when we're gonna get this again <laughs> i just joke man you guys could have been anywhere in the world tonight um but you're here with me and i i appreciate it man yeah shout out to my brother roller man shout out to my brother uh, Pop, I appreciate you guys, you know, watching, uh, you know, watching, watching my, my videos, man. And, um, you know, it, you know, Brittany, I, I, I see you too. You know, I know my boy makes you watch the videos. You know, it's cool. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's all good, man. You know, we, we just gonna, uh, we're gonna let the beat take over. We're gonna let the beat take this one, man. Hopefully you guys, you know, you know, like the beat. I, I, I like it, man. Just, uh, yeah, let it, uh. Let it make you let the beat make you feel whatever you wanted, whatever you want wanted to make you feel. <laughs> You're bored. 